Hello YouTube, this is ODC, that's me, and I'm here with just a uh, channel update and uh, maybe just a couple of little discussions of, you know, ideas for future DC um, Unlimited, they're all called DC Unlimiteds now, but um, I don't know, just a little channel update. I did a little, uh, you know, a little scene here. Um, so Batman just kicking the shit out of of uh, a couple Joker thugs and Jokers to stand there laughing. Got uh, that custom Gagsworth I did a review of. He's like, running after Batman. And we got uh, Batman punching the shit out of this dude right here. He's got two guns in his hands. He's got a bat ring in his hand. He's got the bat signal in the back. This guy's about to whack his ass in the head with a bat. <laughs> I thought that was a cool thing to do. That bat's from the Sportsmaster. Young Justice Sportsmaster. But uh, I'll try to get a... I know my lighting isn't the best, so I'll try to get the best detail I can out of this little setup here. Yeah. But yeah, I just wanted to do this little video, like a little channel update. Show you guys a little scene. You know, I'm not the best ACBA -er, but you know, I like to do it because it's fun. You know, it might not be the best scene, it might not be the most natural looking poses, but I like them. So whatever. But yeah, um, let me know what you guys think for um, figures of 2013. I know we're getting a. Uh, actually bought a Red Hood um, the, off the DC signature line and I got it on eBay uh, it's just not gonna come with packaging or anything I'm gonna, I'm gonna buy another one with uh, mint on card I think but I'm really glad we got a Red Hood it probably wasn't a Red Hood everybody was expecting but I mean it's a Red Hood nonetheless so yeah I think it's pretty cool that we're getting him. I'm gonna get him soon probably. I'll probably get him within the, I don't know, this month, I'd say. At the very latest, at the end of this month. But yeah, somebody leaked something somewhere and I don't know, he wasn't supposed to come out until like May, I think. Uh, I might be wrong, I don't know. Let me know in the comments section what you guys think, but yeah. I think it's, uh, it's pretty cool that we're getting a Red Hood. Uh, I also have a custom Red Hood from Anthony's Customs on its way. That dude does some really good work. I, I can't wait to see that. So that's going to be really cool. I'm excited. And I, I told him I didn't even want to see any any uh, photos of it because I just want to see the final product. I can't wait for it. So he should be sending me that soon. I'll do a video review of that when I get it. But yeah. What do you guys think about uh, 2013? What do you think we should you know what would you like to see for 2013 let me know what you guys think um, a couple other characters like I I'm definitely loving this this new 52 that they're doing they're pumping out new 52 figures um, mo a lot of people don't like new 52 for some reason I love new 52 I think it's it was a good time for them to to uh, reboot it and and redo it I mean they they did it and then Marvel did it with Marvel Now. I think Marvel Now is a little bit more confusing with the way characters look. I mean, character looks one thing in one comic book and looks completely different in another. At least with DC, they're trying to keep it a little bit closer. Um, at least I think they're keeping it a little closer. But yeah, I, uh, I'm a big fan of the New 52 look. I think it's really great. And uh, I think another thing for the line is um, I'm really glad that we got these Movie Masters Joker thugs, and I, I wouldn't mind getting some, getting some like thugs or something like that, you know, just to to uh, make your Rogues Gallery a little bit better, or bigger, or better. I mean, it doesn't even have to be Batman thugs. It could be you know Superman thugs, just a a bank robber or something like that. I mean, we haven't gotten that, and, Mar and Marvel's really good at doing that for us, giving us soldiers and stuff like that. We don't get that from DC. 
I feel like DC doesn't really give us that. So, yeah. Let me know what you guys think about that too. Uh, I'm going to be doing a figure review of the of what I have for Movie Masters. So, yeah, I'm probably going to be doing that. Man, I might just do it tonight. I might just do a big overview and then I'll do an individual review like I've been doing. Um, I usually do the overview. Some people do the overview last. I like to do the overview first. So, yeah, I'll probably do that. I'll probably just do a quick overview and uh, of, of what I have for Movie Masters from the Batman line. Um, yeah, a couple other things on its way. I have a, uh, I have, actually I have two. I have one from Anthony's Customs, uh, two Red Hood figures coming. I have one I, I scooped up off of eBay. And I want to see what the final, you know, I saw a couple photos of it, but, and I didn't pay much for it, so. I'll be doing a review of that also. And, yeah. You know, I decided to change my background too, because it was... It was like camouflaging my figures. I could, it's like you almost couldn't see them in the thumbnail. But yeah, that's a, I like that shot right there. I feel like you guys can't see his his shotgun in the back. I mean, it's black on black, so you can't. It's probably tough to see it. But he's I got him using the Punisher shotgun. I got this guy using the Sportsmaster bat, like I said before. Um, he's using actually he's got the Hit Monkey. Um, I think it's MP5Ks or MP5s. I don't know. Dueling MP5s. I threw both of those in his hand. I thought it looked cool. Like he's getting he's getting rocks from Batman. And then, you know, Gagsworth. I feel like nobody really really knows that much about Gagsworth. Um I mean, you know, what are you supposed to know about him? He's not really featured in much. And they kinda kill I think they haven't really used him either. I'm not sure if they killed him off or whatever, but you know, I mean, me included, I don't know much about him either, so. But let me know what you think. We didn't know what you think about that. And, uh, yeah, I guess we're getting a Injustice Joker coming up. Um, I already pre-ordered the Wonder Woman, the the new Wonder Woman coming out, the new 52 Wonder Woman. That one's going to look sweet. That uh, Or that one's going to be sweet. I've already seen what it looks like. It's pretty cool. It should be coming out, I think... Next couple months, I think it comes out. But, uh, yeah. And I'm also super excited about the, the, um, uh, he's covering his face now. I can't, get, I can't get, like, a good shot here. I gotta re reposition these guys. His arm is, uh, if I touch him, he's gonna fall over. So, I'm <laughs> it took me a while to, to, just to set these two up. I'm not very good at this, like I said, but... Uh, as I was saying, I'm also looking forward to the, um, I can't think today. I'm like having brain farts all over the place. Um, the Dark Knight Returns, bleh, Dark Knight Returns, um, DC Unlimited figure. That one's going to be really cool. I mean, that thing looks awesome. It looks big and bulky and very poseable. It looks much better than, um the DC Direct one that we've already gotten, um, including the one in the four pack, because well, that wasn't really posable. You couldn't really move him that much. His legs were kind of stuck in that weird, awkward position of him like kind of bending, but not really. Kind of looks like he's squatting a little bit. But uh, yeah, and, you know, yeah. Looking forward to those figures. Let me know what you guys think. If you guys have any ideas or anything like that for future figures for DC or or Marvel you know I collect both I love both of them and I'm gonna be doing so that's a cool shot right there man I could get him in there no nah, that looks a little weird I can get him in there no it's not gonna work his arms in the way I get him in closer no it's still not gonna work he's too tall you're too you're too tall anyways but yeah let me know what you guys think I keep getting sidetracked with this <laughs> With this display, I want it to work, and it just doesn't want to work. <laughs> but let me know what you guys think, and yeah, your ideas um, for 2013. I'm excited for 2013. There's gonna be a ton of cool figures coming out. Oh, I also, um, I also have the uh, three Iron Man and the Iron Monger wave. That those will be coming to me soon. I'm gonna do a a review of those guys too. So I got those, I got a ton of stuff coming, uh, a whole bunch of stuff. So 
Ironmonger, Batman, I believe, or <laughs> Batman, Iron Man, <laughs> Batman, Iron Man, um, Ironmonger wave from that. I'm not sure what it's called. If it's technically Marvel Legends, I think it is. I think it's just the Iron Man series of Marvel Legends, but yeah, I got those coming. Iron Patriot, really been waiting a long time for that. I didn't like the other Iron Patriots that came out before that. They're, they didn't seem, they didn't seem as accurate. This one's not eh, not accurate either, but I think it's a little bit more accurate to the comic book. Um, but yeah, there's a bunch of YouTube channel, channels I also wanted to plug to. Um, a lot of good guys out there doing a lot of great reviews for a long time, a lot longer than I've been doing. Actually inspired me and to you know start doing this. And you know, I gotta give a shout out to Shardmus Prime, um, Electric Detonator One. He's really good. Chapman, he's really good. Um, you know, Sean Long, everybody knows that. Um, but uh, yeah, definitely. Oh, Century Productions too. Can't can't forget about him. He's always cool. He's always he seems like a cool dude. I mean, I don't know these guys personally. I just wanted to. I think it's cool that you know us as a collecting community just you know. Just do that for each other, you know. Give everybody a shout out. Give everybody a chance to be viewed on YouTube. But yeah, I just wanted to give you guys a, a quick update on my channel and stuff I'm gonna be doing in the future. I'm, hopefully, I'm gonna be doing more. But uh, yeah, let me know what you guys think. Your your comments are always welcome, whether it be positive or negative. You know, I can take constructive criticism. So. <laughs> let me know what you guys think and yeah i will see you guys next time i'm probably gonna do this review right now bust this review out of the um my movie masters guys so yeah i'll be doing that and i'll probably be doing a lot more i'm gonna finish up that marvel wave and a couple other things over the week so yeah let me know what you guys think for the 50th time i probably said that so <laughs> and i will see you guys next time thanks for watching rate comment subscribe and thank you i'll see you guys next time